Islands of Nature to celebrate the wedding of Sean and Autumn. On behalf of Sean and Autumn, thank you for your presence here today. They also remember other loved ones who cannot be here to share this moment. Marriage is an ancient human tradition. The personal and social merits that accompany the bonds of marriage have led to its continued endurance and has and have paved the way for us to be standing here before God, celebrating the union between these two people. As the Bible reminds us in Corinthians, love is patient, love is kind. It does not envy, it does not boast, it is not proud, it is not rude, it is not self-seeking, it is not easily angered. It keeps no record of wrongs. Love does not delight in evil, but rejoices with the truth. It also protects, always trusts, <coughs> always hopes and always perseveres. Love never fails. As we celebrate this bond of unity today under the eyes of God, it is important that we keep in mind that while this is certainly an occasion of tremendous joy, the promises we witness here today are serious and life-altering commitments. It takes trust to know in your hearts that you will want only the best for each other. It takes dedication to stay open to one another, to learn and grow, even when it's difficult to do so. And it takes faith to go forward together without knowing what the future holds for you both. It is with simultaneous feelings of relation and expressions of respect that we can proceed. At this time, before proceeding with the bonding ceremony, I would invite the couple to share their vows. Sean, would you please deliver yours first? <laughs> Speak loudly. Yeah, I, I will try. Okay. When we first started chatting online uh, a couple of years ago, you know, that online dating thing, uh, I wasn't really looking for anything. Uh, but I thought, wow, she's a typer. I wonder if there could be more. <laughs> so when the time is right, I asked you out on a date, and you said, why not? A girl's got to <laughs> and the date was awesome. Eight and a half hours from start to finish. Great food, great conversation. Uh, when I first saw you, I thought, wow, she's tall. <laughs> uh, I mean, pretty. <laughs> uh, I even thought, I'd date her again. Then you called me the next day and told me you would never date me again. <laughs> Boy, I read that one wrong. <laughs> Luckily, a week later, you asked me out on a date. <laughs> two years later, here we are now. So, Autumn, I choose you. I take you as you are and everything you want to become. I promise you my love, support, and compassion, uh, my time, energy, and affection. I promise to trust. I promise you trust, honesty, and laughter, respect, comfort, and understanding. I promise you all of me, and I'm grateful that today. She's a typer. <laughs> Bear with me. <laughs> Sean, from the moment our paths crossed, you surprised me, distracted me, captivated me, and challenged me in a way that no human being has ever done. I mean, for you to get me to love your feet, I know you must be <laughs> something to me. For those of you that know me well, I hate feet. All joking aside, I've fallen deeply, madly, and truly. I thought I knew what love was. I thought I knew I was at my best until I'd met you. You, Sean, gave me all I never knew I needed. A friend, a partner, a companion, one who loves me, protects me, and our six children. You're an amazing father, a man who's fair, a man who treats me equally, picks me up when I fall is the strong man that I need and the gentle shoulder to rest upon at night. No matter my mood, no matter the type of day I've come to, I come home to you and only you with open arms. Sean, it's not only what you say, it's what you show me. 
I truly believe all you are and can't believe I get to marry the man I never knew existed. I promise to be true to you. Like I said from the very beginning, you'll always know exactly how I feel. And I'll be honest, even if it creates conflict. I promise to be uplifting and supportive to not only you, but Liam, Kira, Declan, Megan, Cassandra, and Michael. I promise I will frustrate you and challenge you, but I'll also be the one to forgive not only you, but myself. I want to share not only the beautiful moments in life with you, but the good, bad, happy, funny, and sad ones too. Someday, if the stars align, I might even let you win an argument, and you know how hard that is for me. No matter the trials we encounter <coughs> together or how much time has passed, I know that our love, respect, admiration, honesty, and friendship will never fade. That we'll always find strength in one another, and that we'll continue to grow side by side. I feel like everything in my life has led me to you, my choices, my heartbreaks, and my fears. When we're together, my past seems worth it. If I had done one thing differently, I might not have found you. To be, to be no other than yourself, loving what I know of you, and trusting who you'll become. I will respect and honor you in all ways. I take you by my, to be my spouse, to have and to hold, even if I'm taller. In tears, and laughter, in sickness, and in health. Just know I didn't fall in love with you. I walked into love with you. With my eyes wide open, choosing to take every step along the way. I do believe in fate and destiny, but I also believe we already are fated to do the things we choose anyway. Sean, I choose you in a hundred lifetimes, in a hundred worlds, in any versions of reality. And on this beautiful day, I want to thank you for the wonderful life you have given me. In return, I give you my heart forever, and I promise to you always that I'll give you head rubs and foot rubs, neck rubs, and take care of you the best way that I know how. I promise to be faithful to you and to be forever by your side. You'll never have to face anything in life alone. I give you my hand to hold and life to keep. May you never forget how we felt when we first realized that our love was what it was. May the bond that we make today never be broken, and may it only continue to grow. Today and for the rest of my living days, I'll love you with all that I am. Sean <laughs> and Autumn, please join me. You take Autumn as your cherished wife in front of these witnesses and promise to stay by her side through sickness and health, joy and sorrow, so long as you both shall live. You do. Autumn, will you take Sean as your cherished, cherished husband in front of these witnesses and promise to stand by his side through sickness and health? I do. Enjoy. Sorry, enjoy and sorrow. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I do. I do. I do. I do. The wedding rings perfectly symbolize the never-ending love you two have for each other. By exchanging these rings, you solidify the lifelong commitment to one another. The rings serve as a welcome and constant reminder of the bond you formed with your partner. I, Sean, give you autumn. I, Sean, give you autumn. This ring is a symbol of my enduring love. This ring is a symbol of my enduring love. Just as the circle of the ring completes itself. Just as the circle of the ring completes itself. You complete me. You complete me. Hi, Autumn. Give you Sean. Hi, Autumn. Give you Sean. This ring is a symbol of my enduring love. Just as the circle of the ring completes itself. Just as the circle of the ring completes itself. So you complete. So you complete. Sean and Autumn, by the power vested in me by 
the great state of Michigan. I am pleased to pronounce you husband and wife sealed together today. <laughs> sealed together today, both in law and love under the eyes of God. Sean, you may kiss your bride. I now have the privilege of presenting for the very first time Mr. and Mrs. Sean Murphy. Yeah.